Hello everyone, welcome to Liberable and welcome to a new video here on Liberable. We are going to chat about some of my experience and some of the best sounding cars here in Mzanzi and a bit of throwback to everything that I've done so far on Liberable. Not everything, but enough to see where I've come from and where I'm going with the channel. I'm heading back to Kilani Robot Racing soon, so I thought this would be a good time um, to see some of the old things I've done and also listen to some of the best sounding cars I've ever heard um, here in South Africa. I mean, we have an amazing collection of cars. So if you are watching all over in the States and America and you hear Ranix RSI, I know your guys' versions are called XRXs, um, your Nissan Centers are called Nissan Sunnies. This is just going to be a tour of some of the nicest sounding metal in Mzanzi. I think let's kick it off and before I do I have an issue there's no notifications going out with uh, out from Liberable so please make sure you have the notification bell hit at the bottom it is hitting Liberable's use extremely hard because people's coming up to me at garages and if I go like dude where have you been you haven't been on YouTube and I'm like I've been making videos every week so it turns out YouTube just not putting us up on the algorithm I suppose so please guys hit the notification bell and also comment down below on this video what was your favorite sounding car here on Liberable one of my all time favorite sounding four cylinder cars this is one of the four cylinder cars I'm going to mention in this video is Toyota's Ranix RSI hello everyone welcome to Liberable <laughs> That is almost certainly one of the best sounding forces in the cars here in South Africa. Honda's K20 is very close, but it doesn't have that, that sort of deepness and just orchestra that um, the Ranix RSI has. Definitely one of the nicest sounding forces in the engines out there. And that thing also is quite a nice car, pretty reliable as well. All these cars on this list are the best. So we're not doing a countdown, nothing like that. This is just some of the best sounding metal I've heard here on Level Rebel. Never, ever, ever, ever with the spider on my camera get bored of the sound of the M156 6.2 liter V8 to the point where I actually bought um, a CLK 63 MG because I wanted to own a car with the M156 engine. So, yeah. what type of video isn't complete without a BMW 3 to 5 IS and its magnificent 2.5 liter? m20 straight six engine by two and a half i mean it's an is so it's a 2.7 liter <laughs> i mean <ever? laughs> what a car i'm gonna say this video wow 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 like in you know, other videos you guys are gonna complain i say wow too much On the topic of great sounding six cylinders, we have to listen to Nick's E36 M3.
that specific car had a carbon airbox on and it, oh, I remember that day as clear as yesterday. It sounded fantastic. On the topic of one of the best sounding cars I think I've ever heard, you have to listen to this. Yeah. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Art Maserati Quattro Porte GTS was almost certainly spine tinglingly good. And that video is in the card on top, in one of those two corners. All the videos that, I'm, that, I'm, that you're seeing here is on Liberable and you can actually watch the video right now. These are... Oh, I can't get enough of the sound of that car. Like, I had tears in my eyes so good it was. Speaking of Italian cars, Ferrari is on top of its game. So we can have a bit more forgiveness on this very rough road. My God. The 458 Italia was I'm not gonna lie, a highlight of my career. It's something I always wanted to drive. It's such a huge accomplishment. I am completely speechless that I even got to drive a 458 Italia. Ferrari recently launched the, I forget the name, but it's a 2.9 liter V6. And it sounds like a V12. They managed to get the exhaust to sound like a V12. Like, flipping heck. What is a sound video without the beautiful VR6. That is a flipping stunning sound. <laughs> There's some intake. <laughs> yeah? Makes it deeper. Makes it deeper. You get a the 2.8 and 3.2 liter V6 engine from VW, which is a inline like a VR6. Magnificent. It is a South African icon. Like the sound of that car, just I think everyone at my age has great memories of that sound coming up a road. Speaking of the VW Group cars, the Audi R8 V10 performance was another car I could not believe I got to drive. It was nothing. Get back. I mean, that sound. Now, that sound gets thrown around a lot on Liberable, but I think the word that sound was made famous by this video. Don't forget, www.liberable.co.za. Something amazing is coming. I mean, that was 
an amazing experience for me. The Joburg or the, the Pretoria PE, I think it was PE, was phenomenal. And to drive that car and to experience, to share it with all of you, was absolutely amazing. <laughs> the track hawk was and will always remain one of my favorite suvs money can buy i'm not in the point of my career where i can buy a one and a half million rand car i hope i get the opportunity to if liberable make some good sales and some sponsors come on board that would be the car i buy i freaking adore a track hawk I mean, if you put an exhaust on the thing, do a supercharger pulley, you have a thousand horsepower SUV. I love that car. And talking about some of my dream cars, Porsche. The Carrera S Tech Art was definitely one of my favorite sounding cars. And thank you so much to Gino actually for letting me drive that car a few years ago. I still can't believe as well I got the opportunity to do that. Now, the Nissan R34 GTR. The Nissan R34 GTR. I can't even believe I got to drive inside that car. Like even just talking about it now is sending tingles down my spine. But the one thing that I'm so proud about is this. Don't know if it's gonna start, but this car is filthy. Oh. Nope. Mm -mm. Ah. Yo. And that is exactly why I have to sell this car because I do not use it. So, if anyone wants to buy a CLK 63 AMG, please message me. Car's extremely neat. Got the, can need a few, need a few touch-ups here and there. But yeah, car is super neat. I'll even give you a full tank of fuel. <laughs> but I managed because I'm someone who loves the sound of cars. I had to own um, this CLK 63 AMG because of its M156 engine. It sounds absolutely magnificent. And I want to thank you guys for five years of YouTube, five years of Liberable. I really appreciate it. It's been a massive journey on this channel and there are still amazing content to come. I'm looking forward to see where this channel goes in the next few months. It has slowed down quite a bit. YouTube is not sharing our videos. It's sad, I mean, a lot of work, a lot of effort went into this channel and COVID knocked my views hard as well. If you wanna watch some of those amazing car sounds, all the links are in the little arrow on top in the corner of the screen. I always forget which side. But it's been a fantastic journey listening to all these cars and getting to drive all the cars. I absolutely enjoyed myself and I'm looking forward to see what robot racing is like in the next few weeks. I'm, I would like to race this car, but I just, I don't, I don't want to hurt it. 
I am gonna race something actually, so look out for that video, it's gonna be quite amazing. You wanna see how that car does on the track. And um, yeah, be free with you, love